when I first started thinking about like living unplugged, I realized like, I, it's not something I can do on my own. Hello? Hi. Hey. Hey. How's it going? As I have talked about the idea of moving to a more like off-grid lifestyle, I've connected with a lot of really great people who are interested in that as well. Can I just say that I'm really happy that we're all together here in Tennessee, finally making our dream happen. Up to this point, we've been video conferencing and sending emails back and forth. So this is the first time we're actually going to meet each other as we begin to try an unplugged experience. There is a lot of interest out there, and I think people just want to see it be more accessible to them. We really gelled as a team and did things that um, were difficult and were challenging, but we didn't allow them to get the best of us at any point. You can research the hell out of anything. Until you get doing it, you're not gonna know. Are they coming? No. Let's go! Yeah. Any one task wouldn't have been so hard, but then piled back to back to back, um, while it is probably a lot like um, unplugged living. By the end of the first day, we were pretty sore. I think the most important thing was not so much whether they can live unplugged or not. I think they knew they could. I think it's whether they'd get along together during the process. I think we work pretty well together, which creates a sense of trust. And we have a lot more similarities and, and common interests than I could have hoped for. I mean, overall, you guys look like you got along well. Really, no, no real major issues. It's been good. I mean, we've been learning a lot about working together. I think you guys are gonna do great no matter what happens. Thank you so much, Jay. My pleasure, yeah. man.